all right everyone welcome back to more final fantasy 16 my keyboard was blocking my interface so i could not see if a uh, voice was getting recorded correctly or not okay we will continue with the main mission we did three other side missions outside of the video those were important ones because one of them gave us a new sword the one that clive has now it's called excalibur yeah okay let's go so there is a side mission here and that will go to the steps of the forgotten we'll continue on foot no point in oh what's that there's just a closed door huh this game is long so i've been it making more than the merchants crossing the scars till the republic laid a new road wide enough to let wagons pass and all official traffic moved there leaving this one for those living outside the law indeed I doubt we'll be the only outlaws on the trail today. Okay. Foreshadowing. So, yeah, I was going to say something. Forgot now. You guys are not outlaws. You are... You are outplanned. Oh, you are still not dead. Finished. Um. So they basically attacked this wagon and broke it. What do you guys need? What do you think? Really? It's as bad as that. Oh, why? There's trouble up ahead, and too much of it for us to handle. I take it there's danger on the road. Oh, what about this fearsome-looking fellow? You think he'd be equal to the task? Oh, no doubt. Assuming he's willing to hear us out. Well met, friend. How does a merchant misplace his car? Oh, the man's a coward. He's not with each other. Well, if I'm going to have to deal... You've clearly got... We're lucky now. Reckon he... All right. No, no. You just put in it. So they are not going to help. I'm not sure I trust those two. But if there are bandits lying in wait, I should probably take... <laughs> Look lively, you lot. No. We've got guests. Someone. These must be our bandits. Oh. <laughs> Thousand, not bad. guys are punks for our level oh is that a new level yeah level 36 that's them dealt with no oh, why is that card so 
So most of the the corners and stuff is just for show, essentially. Getting all of this out of here will be a nightmare. Seems we found ourselves the right man for the job. Found the canoe. It's been a pleasure. Isn't it? What? Get cart. <laughs> Instead of get carter, there was a movie, a very well known movie called Get Carter. Um, in fact, I remember the first one was a British one. Um, I don't know if the latest one is that same story I or not. I haven't. Lag behind Rosaria when it comes to bridge building. The fallen ruin should hold at least. That's a fallen ruin. So are we expecting some ruin guardians or stuff? Yes, as I expected. Come on, dudes. That's some weak as guardian, although they managed to uh, hit me once or twice. So, what was there on the other side? There, was, I, I just came, have, you know, randomly to this left side. What was on the right side? Oh, so this is just a man. That's a that's a huge hole. That's it. Oh, no, this is where we came from. So it's just both of them comes to the same place. That's a massive hole. Finally, we are here, Bokla. Oh, it's not the city. We are just overlooking the city. Oh no, it's something else. The final sin. Don't make any problem. So this is a Mechis. The land of the gods. It's even more impressive than I imagined. I remember being captivated by the story as a child. Long, long ago, man was overcome by avarice and challenged the gods in a bid to win their power. A final battle took place here, at these falls. Or so the legend goes. If anyone ever manages to plumb those depths, perhaps we'll learn if there's any truth to the tale. That the gods emerged victorious and punished man for his defiance by visiting upon him two curses. Exactly. Dominance and bearers. Why would dominance and bearer be truth. cursed? I always thought it strange that the dominant and their icons were deemed a curse. Back home, the dominant inherited the throne. They were admired and exalted, not spurned. Whenever I got to that part of the story, I always assumed there must be something I'd misunderstood. You had a lot of storybooks, didn't you? In your room, I mean. When we were young. The old legends were always my favorites. Epic battles between gods and men. Father encouraged me to read as much as I could. 
You thought it good for my education. You really were a boy like any other, weren't you? Just look at this place. It's enough to make you believe the legends are true. I know. We're not far from Boklad. The road will be busier up ahead. And we'll have to keep our wits about us. <laughs> Let's go! Something wrong? Nothing. It's nothing. That's a beautiful view. Oh, the story continues. See the reports are true, Father. You have surrendered the throne to Olivier. I have. Emperor Olivier shall rebuild the Holy Empire of Sambre. How is he to rule an empire? He is but a boy. I shall advise him until he comes of age. Father, please. Or for as long as I am able. The empire we seek to build needs young blood to rule. And I can think of none better suited to the task. There is other news, Dion. Hugo Kupka is dead, and Drake's Fang destroyed. The pillars of the Republic have fallen. Ere long, the Imperial banner shall fly over every city in storm. At the same time, he dreams of then conquest. Valisthea. All shall bow before their Emperor. Father, these are the words of a tyrant. They are the words of a god. The Emperor whom I gladly serve. Great Grieger made flesh. He not only made the other guy Emperor, he's rubbing it on this guy's face. Did he forget this guy is uh, dominant? To camp, and that too. And ready your forces. Bahamut. It is time to show the world the true power of Sambrek. Father. <laughs> I find you much changed. Is this truly the path you wish to tread? Or are these the ambitions of another? Of Ultima, perhaps? Oh. What nonsense is this? He was told about Anna Ultima. I speak my mind. And my mind only. Though I do owe Annabella thanks for reminding me of certain truths. Regarding the nature of nation, of rulers, and of the divine. She knew what strings to pull. You would trust the words of this traitress. She betrayed her country. She slew her husband. You have ever been an invaluable servant to Sambrek, Prince Dion. I trust you will continue to serve your emperor in the wars to come. Silence! Insolent wretch! You will bend the knee. All else is heresy. Sire, forgive me. Something, something. 
Come, your radiance. The Rowena Syndicate awaits your pleasure. No, not another meeting with silly old men. They're so boring. Oh, look at his toy with burning eyes. I'm hungry, father. Can't we have luncheon instead? Does it pain you that you will not inherit your father's throne? She is rubbing it in now. I have suffered worse. <laughs> Count your blessings, Dion. For a baseborn child to be chosen by Bahamut is miracle enough. You have risen high on his wings, but you shall rise no higher, lest your impure blood stain the throne. Oh, Do here you also of my blood. Here also there is blood in the equation. I hope we get to kill this lady. Like Clive gets to kill this lady. Okay, here we are. The yeah, they made a very, very unlikable character. Like evil to the core. You won't believe there are people like this in the real world. Who think too much about their own bloodline and blood. What were they guarding here? Nothing. Okay. I guess we should call a chocobo. Ready, go. Let's go. Fly, Ambrosia. Infiltrating the Dominion won't be easy with the Imperials on high alert. No. His radiance has lost one capital already. We can be sure Sylvester will do everything in his power to hold on to Twinsight. His troops are well trained and increasingly battle hardened. But it's not as if we can wait for the siege to end. Okay, where does so we are supposed to go left? Where does the right go? Uh, we'll go up to that gate and then come back. They've closed the road to Randalar. If the siege breaks, they'll need more than this to stop the Imperial Legions marching on the capital. Oh, so this is the road to Randalar. Okay. So we need to Let's go. Faster. That's why we are going to Bookland. Can I catch that? No, I don't want to fight you guys. More refugees. And they're all making for the crystalline dominion. Because they don't know how to live without the crystal's blessing. Oh, you guys won't won't stop charging? <laughs> Seven seventy five. Do I have enough to upgrade anything? Um, I don't want this one. Although this one does like four to two. I can upgrade this one. We'll wait till eight hundred. Here we go. Is this Booklard? The Booklard markets, okay. There are no crystals here. Yep. This is where we're supposed to meet Goots, isn't it? That's right. 
He said he'd wait for us here after replenishing his supplies. I dare say he'll have finished by now. Side missions? Doesn't look like any. Let me carry your goods. I'm cheap. I'm cheap. What are you looking for? Many thanks. Many thanks. Where are you, goods? Wonders from across the water. Come one, come all. Feast your eyes. Good sir, can I interest you in... How much? For a measly crust of bread? You won't find any cheaper. Not nowadays. They are more than welcome to look. Empire's unlawful and illegitimate occupation of the Crystalline Dominion is still in effect. Only those whose business in Twinside has been officially approved by the Republican Army will be permitted to cross the border. All who seek entry are to form a line and ready their documents for inspection. It looks like we aren't the only ones who are eager to leave. And they're checking everyone. Can't you make an exception? Not for the likes of you. We won't get through without that pass. Let's go and find good, shall we? He must be around here somewhere. It's my peaches! They're sweet as nectar! Where are you, good? You won't find anything of this quality in Twinside. Oh, he's here. Oh, good. There you are. Clive, I, I'm so sorry. Don't tell Nan, will you? Slow down, good. Just tell us what happened. It's me trader's pass. It's gone. We cannot ride the caravan without it. We won't even be able to get through the flipping checkpoint. Do you remember when you last saw it? It was in me pocket a minute ago. And then a band bumped into me, and yeah, you don't think that they might have nicked it, do you? It wouldn't surprise me. A busy market like this is prime territory for pickpockets. So, to get the pass back, we need to find this child. Where would we even start? <gasps> I, I know where. I've got a pal in Bocklad who might be able to help us. No one knows more about what goes on round here than she does. Where do we find her? She's the owner of the Crimson Caravans, up that way. Sign's got a red chocobo on it. No time like the present. You two go on ahead. I'm gonna check the rest of my stuff, make sure no one else is missing. All right. We'll meet you there. Let's keep an eye out for this red chocobo, then. And the other on our purses. Next to the checkpoint. There it is, Crimson Caravans. <sighs> no? Our new arrivals had brought any coin with them. Oh, is this the Red Chocobo? Yes. Looking to hire a coach? It's ten million for a two-birder to the Crystalline Dominion. Take it or leave it. Oh, we're not here for that. Then I bid you good day. Oh, wait! Just don't go, Elle! He's been made. As I live and breathe. Goots, what are you doing back in Bocklad? Looks like Bayonetta. <laughs> I gather Lady Karen didn't send you.
So what trouble have you got yourself into this time? Uh, it's me trader's pass. It got stolen. By little Ben. Of all the... You're the size of a marble. Honestly. Ugh. Goots told us that you know the markets well. Might you have an idea which little Ben could have done this? We don't intend to punish them. We just need our pass back. Then, we can be on our way. I see. So neither of you has a trader's pass either. <laughs> Not that anyone would take you for traders. But I suppose that's why you came to me, correct? Now, I can't say for sure who took your pass. But I suspect I know why they did it. Let me explain. The explaining is done. Ever since Out. the fist marched on the Dominion, no. the Republic has been clamping down on any commerce that might aid the Empire more than it does us. Which means traders' passes have gone from being merely a way of easing one's progress to being essential if one wishes to cross the border at all. And with demand outstripping supply, they've become a precious commodity, leading some to seek to acquire them by less than legitimate means. So the children are stealing passes to sell on the black market? Yes and no. Passes are inscribed with the names of their owners, and yet, none of the victims' names have appeared on the register of those passing through the checkpoint. Which means? That someone is doctoring the stolen passes. The same someone who is encouraging the children to steal them. And the same someone who has Goots's pass, no doubt. Whoever they are, they're ruining the livelihoods of honest merchants. Which is why we've decided to take a stand. Will you stand with us? You want to get your pass back. And we want to ensure that no more are stolen. Catch whoever's behind it all, and two birds shall be slain with a single stone. Is there any other way of getting to the Crystalline Dominion goods? They won't let you in if you're not with the caravan. It's that, uh... But... The guards will definitely spot you if you try and do that. Like, we don't want to get spotted, right? So either we find the people who took the pass, or give up all hope of entering the... All right. We'll help. Thank you kindly. Yeah. But I don't know your name. Eloise at your service. Clive. A pleasure doing business with you, Clive. What is she giving us? Oh, another seal, crimson color. The proprietor of the furniture makers by the coach stop is spearheading the search. Wear that, and he will know you for a friend. I suggest that you speak with him first. The furniture makers. Understood. Okay, that's our main quest, so that we will prioritize it. Okay, so no side missions here. Only the main mission to get the pass back. Out of my sight, wretch. To catch a thief. Come on, come on. Jug of snake spit for the road. The caravan stops next. There is the furniture maker. Are you the furniture maker? Looking for something in particular? Ah. I know where he's collared you too, eh? Collared you too. Then I expect you want to know more. She told me you were leading the hunt for the pickpockets. What have you learned? For one, that they're targeting the traders carrying the biggest packs. Harder to watch your back, see? And less chance of the mark giving chase if they're spotted. Not that they'd be likely to catch them. Those imps know every inch of this warren like the backs of their hands. Their eyes must have lit up when they saw Goots. The fishmonger round by the gate's been trying to track down the children involved. You should go and have a word with her. Thank you. 
Okay, so the fishmonger, the other way. Look at those silver down. plates. Come taste my peaches. They're sweet. You should come with me to the Dominion. Life will be fish for sale. Can I interest you? She's asked me to help her. Is that for one? Street orphans from the wars. A few, perhaps. You saw the refugees go. They're all looking for a new start in the Dominion and beyond. Some of them take it as an opportunity to rid themselves of unwanted baggage. The shame of it. They leave their children. This would have to have made themselves known to the children at some point. And so should we. You should start with the children around here then. I doubt they're the ones involved, but they might have heard something. It's worth a try. All right then. Okay, Question finally we are getting to the children. Quest destination nearby. Oh, there is one. Excuse me. Do you mind if I ask you something? Can't stop you. Can't stop I was you. Just wondering if anyone has asked you to do anything out of the ordinary recently. Anything grown-ups ever ask us to do is shut up and go away. So guess what I'm about to tell you to do? Sorry. I'll leave you alone. That was a very good answer. So it's that way. is to know who's asking children like you to pick pockets. I don't know. No, what's picking pockets? No, uh, you get in <laughs> trouble for it. So if they come calling, you... Jug of snakes, Smith. <sighs> what do you want? It's all right. We're not going to help. We've heard that some very bad people are making children like you steal from travelers. We need to know who's behind it so we can... I don't know much about it, really. He said he got a job doing something. Sounds promising. We need to find... Do you know where... He's usually... Thank you. Okay. Finally, we have a name. Hunza. Find Hunza. So time is hard for Rangers everyone with all these wars. And now uh, empire after empire falling under our blade. It's understandable. Everyone is having a hard time. She must have been the refugee camp. Let's hope he's still nearby. <laughs> that big fat donkey was easy pickings. He wouldn't have noticed if we robbed his boots off him. <laughs> yeah. Wish we hadn't handed over the pass, though. Could use one of those things to get out of this dump. Chance would be a fine thing. The moment they found out, they'd string us up by our guts. Would they now? Perhaps you'd like to introduce us to these charming characters. Shit, we're in trouble now. What do we do? You two get caught if you want. I'm off. Hunter, where are you? He going? says I am off. <laughs> he just keeps running. So that He's was Hunter, eh? Jill, you watch these two. I'm going after him. All right. He can't have gone far. I need to find him before his employers do. Daddy! Did you see a boy run past? There was a boy ran back there towards the chocobo pen, but... Thank you. He's not here. Oh, shit. Cornered. It's all right. You Hunter. are just a kid. I'm not going to hurt you. I just want to ask you some questions. <sighs> Fine. I don't like I've got a choice. 
I'm looking for the people who are making you steal for them. Who are they? Call themselves the Carl Stones. They said they'd give me good gill if I did what they told me. I knew they were bad, but it doesn't come for free. Didn't come at all half the time before I started buzzing for them. You know, if I didn't do it, they'd just pick on someone else. Someone they could push around easier. Hansa. You found him then? Jill. Where are the other two? Eloise is watching over them. She sent Goots and I to look for you. <laughs> you him! I haven't got your pass anymore, if that's what you're after. I gave it to the Car Stones. Whatever you do to me, I can't get it back. Not that I go against them anyway. If it weren't for their gill, me and my mates would have starved. Cowards! You will not force another child to do your bidding. Wait, we're not... Don't hurt him! Who is this guy? You're making a mistake. We're on the same side. Like hell we are. That brute. Where did you get it? M Master Theo. <laughs> Goots. What are you doing with these people? Unless you're the ones my sister was talking about. <laughs> now he remembers. Eloise didn't tell us she had a brother. And why would she? I'm just her back and a blade. Theodore, at your service. Sorry about before. Theodore, what do you know of the cast stones? Vultures who have made Balklad their hunting ground. They prey on the desperate, stealing from those with Gil and bullying those without it into joining their flock. I'd been looking into their activities in hope of sparing the refugees any further hardship. But it seems they've already stooped even lower than I'd feared. Hans is a good lad. Don't blame him for what they've made him do. If he and his friends hadn't agreed to work for the stones, some other poor souls would have. On pain of death, most likely. Clive, was it? And my sister has asked you to help put an end to the pickpocketing. Then we all want the same thing. So you don't get the experience point from these missions if there is no fighting involved. Okay, let's oh, talk to him. Where is he? So, what's the plan? What else? We find the cast stones and we crush them. Yep. You get the your traders pass back and I make Boglad a safe place again. All right then. All right then. Honza, where are they camped? Don't worry. They'll never know you told us. Couldn't if I wanted to. They always come to town to collect the passes. They meet us outside the gate. I tried following them once, but they spotted me halfway down the trail. Said they'd string me up. We'll try it this time. Which way were they going? Back down the road towards Leighton's Cleft. To Leighton's Cleft, then? Blood from the stone. Lady's cleft is to the south, past the camp. No, better not have scared any of my. This brothers. is no time to ride. That's that then. Daddy. There are no crystals here. So people, humans, basically, they are lost without crystal. The steps of the forgotten. So now all those animals are gone. We'll have to fight these guys.
det är det är. Are you guys mad? We'll stick more than nose. Let's go. Probably end up being a boss fight. More of these guys. This time two healers. We got You're not killing anyone. Fewer now. Yep. Let's go. Let's find the rest. Oh, this is where their tent is. So some big guys. Oh, yep. There is a big guy. Not a bad haul today, eh? Aye. Some of our new recruits are natural born ne'er do wells. Especially <laughs> scum. The leaders of the. They don't deserve any mercy, Clive. I wasn't planning on showing them any. We're ready. Oh, I'm ready. <laughs> Come on. Fuck. That guard from Clockland. Kill him. Kill them all. And they say crime doesn't pay. Gold chains, rings, purses. Ah, and traders' passes. Dozens of them. Have the names been changed? Not yet. I recognize some of them. No doubt Goots's is somewhere among them. Now I just need to sort through it all and return everything to the people it was taken from. We should go and give Eloise the good news. Can we leave things here in your hands, Theodore? Of course. Oh, and uh, be sure to tell her of the part I played, won't you? <laughs> we'll be glad to. Yep, we will definitely do. I don't know why I'm not fast traveling.
Oh, that's break. goes the hunt my brother isn't getting in your way I trust quite the opposite so it was the cast stones who were behind it all Theo told me he'd been on their trail and their demise solves three problems at a stroke that of the pickpockets the bandits pulling their strings, and the passes they were stealing. I only hope yours is among the items you recovered. Only time and Theo's return will tell. Speaking of whom, welcome home, dear brother. You are too kind, Eloise. Here, Clive. Goods is pass. Ask him to keep a closer eye on it from now on, would you? I will. Thank you. El, I've asked our boys to carry the rest of the goods back. Can I count on your help in sorting through it all? Of course. I'll make some space in the storeroom. I expect you'll soon be on your way, then. But it wouldn't do to leave without introducing yourself properly. Would it now? Sid. Don't look so shocked. We're on the same side. <laughs> I don't understand. As you now know all too well, we at the Crimson Caravans are always happy to help those in need. For a small fee, we will move anything that needs moving. Be that goods to market, or bearers away from it. I was the first my sister helped escape. If it wasn't for her, I'd have been branded as a boy. I had no idea. It just so happens that we are seeking to expand our operation. And who better to join forces with than the leader in the field? Wouldn't you agree, Theo? I would. It seems our purpose is the same in more ways than one. So what would you say to working together again? It would be our pleasure. And our honor. The honor is ours. Here, Clive. This is for you. Crimson Compass from Theod. What is it? El has friends in high places while I have associates in uh, lower ones. That mark is proof that you're a friend to us both. I shall bear it with pride. Well, all that remains is to wish you a safe onward journey. Goots's pass should secure you a place on the caravan, but if you encounter any difficulties, we would be delighted to provide you with a coach of our own. For a discounted price, of course. Say... Nine million? Nine million? Try the caravan. Yeah, we don't have nine million... Traders pass. Okay. Right then. Let's get this back to Goots. And then it's on to the Dominion. Um. Well met. We don't need hey, any of Gilbert, those. Out of my sight, Pony. I Look at all these traders. Do you see pairs? Slake your 
really want to be in. Here you are, good. Try not to lose it again. Me pass? You found it! Oh, thank you so much. Nan would have killed me if I'd come back without it. He's on me. Say thanks to Ellen, Theo too. So should you, Hansa. You and your friends don't have to steal anymore. If anyone threatens you again, you know who to turn to. We do. And we already have. Ms. L's given us a job shifting the chocobo shit out of the stables. And it's hard work, and the pay isn't half what we got from the stones. But if we stick at it, we'll keep us... <laughs> you? And Goots, I'm sorry... Uh, that's all right. I've got it back now. Uh, and... I you said you're trained to be a blacksmith, right? Well, I'm going to be your first customer. I'm going to save up all my gear and get you to me. Oh, oh, <laughs> These two have become friends. Okay. Finally, are we passing through the checkpoint? All right. We have a place on the wagon. Remember, Goots, we're mercenaries. You hide us to protect you. But mercenaries. <laughs> He's going to remember the plan. You're to ride all the way to Twinside. Jill and I will go with you as far as the outskirts, then find our own way in. I'll buy that stuff I need. Right. And we'll scout out the Imperials' defences. There's a square with a big bell tower right in the middle of town. If you get lost, or out goes wrong, we can meet up there. All right. Let's go. Certain your father has no knowledge of Ultima. I am. I have no difficulty believing a sinister force has come to exert an influence on Sanbrek. But be that as it may, it is yet to claim my father. For better or worse, his radiance speaks his own mind. Then the fiend works from the shadows. I confess, when first you told me of this fiend, I had my doubts, and more than a few at that. A beast that labors to plunge Valisthea into turmoil, all in pursuit of your brother. But that wound is proof enough that evil is afoot. Then I have your answer, your highness. You will join me in my fight. I cannot. Not yet. Your Highness, please. As you are aware, the Dalmechian army is at our gates. They have lost their mother crystal, and with it all hope of a negotiated withdrawal. It is but a matter of time before they invade. If Bahamut is not here to meet them, my people will be slaughtered. He is... Basically, the character for for the next not king. Like Hugo Kupka, thanks to Ultima's machinations. I know the fate of your people weighs heavy on your conscience, but if we do not put an end to Ultima's plans, they shall face a far darker fate. The chaos he would wreak would sweep all of Valisthea into the abyss. The lives of every man, woman, and child in the Twins are at stake. I believe what you say, Phoenix. I have duties of my own, and I must discharge them. Come what may. What do you know of my blood? Oh, you're back here. 
I know that it is wholly unworthy of the highest offices of state, which rightly belong to those of purer breeding. Alas. Your bloodline runs through the Oriflam gutter, from a whore who weighed her child's worth in gill. Have you threatened my father? <laughs> of course not. I merely whispered in his ear that his mongrel son is plotting a rebellion. What? Sylvester listens to the words of his astrologers. And they have ears too. You have been feeding them your lies! Should you remain loyal to Emperor Olivier, his radiance may yet crown your head with laurel, and not with tar. <gasps> Fork-tongued witch! <laughs> Why did you stop? Why didn't you just kill her and then say sorry? In consideration of your long years of service to the Empire, I shall forgive this uncharacteristic rudeness. Now hurry and make ready, your Imperial Highness. Emperor Olivier expects much of you, Dion. Or should I say, of Bahamut. They are playing with fire. Reduce his enemies to ash. And she's also playing All it. The Falisthea bows to its rightful ruler. It's not Ultima. She is the biggest, biggest evil in in this game. another darkness that has taken hold of Sandbrack. And until its grip is released, the flames of war shall spread ever wider, just as Ultima wishes. Forgive me. My family has caused you much grief. You are not her keeper, Phoenix. This is a matter for the Imperial household now, and as a member of that household, it falls to me to resolve it. At such time as that is done, what strength I have shall be yours. Thank you, Your Highness. Mm. Let us take to the skies together and bring a new dawn to Valisthea. I should like nothing more. Terence. My prince. Tell me true. Do you believe what I'm about to do is wrong? I... We Dragoons have but one leader, Your Highness. And we shall follow him unto the very end. Thank you. This is my decree. For their crimes against the Crown, the traitorous Annabella and her usurping son shall be put to death and the Empire restored. Oh, we are directly going to the capital. Twin side. One would never guess that these people stood on the brink of war. When they're afraid, they turn to drink to forget their fears. Anything you want to forget?
The harbor is empty, and half the market stores too. The city may seem peaceful on the surface, but it's balanced on a knife edge. Were we to give it a nudge, it might be just the distraction we need to reach the Mother Crystal. I thought you might say that. We should send for Gav. We'll need someone to keep the fires we start from going out. And we can busy ourselves scheming until he gets here. I'll send a Stolas then. <sighs> Something is bothering him. What happened? Fire in the sky. The city's on fire. I'm sure Goose is fine. He'll be making for the square. The one with the bell tower. In the middle of town, right? Oh, man. Watchman, sentry, everyone is to be slain Those on sight. Imperial dragoons. Imperial dragoons. So, in the meantime, I actually have gone and taken care of three side missions back in the last place. Exactly. What's see. going on? Right. But first we find goats. I just hope he's all right. So I am continuing like after two days. Oh, look at these guys. came from here we'll have to continue over here more of them 
New enemies approach. Oh. Okay. So um, what happened is let me let me first say what happened. I have a PS4 which is connected to the exact same circuit. Today while cleaning my uh, desk, I by mistake switched it on, and in the middle of this fight, somehow um, Elgato decided that it needs to move back to that PS4. And I lost that fight completely and uh, I like gave up. I took so much damage. I'm like, uh, let's not continue. We'll fight with that guy over here. Come on, Dragon Lancer. Too late. Exactly. Is it a civil war? So we came from that side. More? <sighs> that took care of them. Dethrone the pretender. There it is. The bell tower. Right. Let's go. Goods left. We're in Frigga's name. 
More enemies. That is done. <laughs> I'm just uh, attacking that because it was right there. Okay. So the whole place is burning. Right here. Damn it. We'll have to find a way around. Something big is coming up, I'm sensing. Oh, there Marcus, is the tower. We're coming. Okay. We are quite far away from the tower. Shut up. Oh. Oh. 
Come on. This one big guy with other small guys are always a problem. Okay, let's go. Yeah, one big, big enemy you can concentrate on it. But one big enemy with some small enemies are not good. We are going underground again. Enemies on the ramparts! Kill them! Fever of Art, Raging Feast. Boss fight. Dragon. Can you see him anywhere? So hitting this guy is going to be tough.
What's happening? So much happening on the screen. Shit! I'm in a corner.
white one bone. I have used up so much of health. I <laughs> use all right. Dragon. All right, let's get out of here. Oh. What now? Is that Mother Crystal's heart? What the hell is it doing up there? Bahamut has become mad. Your Highness, don't do this. We must leave. Now, Your Grace, I beg of you. This is not what he wanted. Something's happened. Forgive me, Yoda, but I must put a stop to this. Your Grace! Here comes Phoenix! Is he trying to hit the heart or...? Yeah, he is. And the heart hits back. Ooh. The mountain disappears. Oh. And because he attacked the heart. It's creating a, a crystal barrier. Now then, we destroy the heart. We might come back as soon as the flames die down. The Imperials and the Dalmex will move in. This may be our only chance. And Bahamut has gone for now. You should get as far away as you can, Goots. What? A new view slot in the ledge? I can't do that. If you're staying. Then so am I. I. I packed everything up before I made a run for it. So if there's out, <laughs> it's it's out in the need, <laughs> well, I won't be giving it away for free. Nana'd never forgive us if I did. Thank you, Goods. So Goods is going to open up shop here. That's good for us. 
because we need some potions. We have used up quite a lot in the dragon fight. Good stole, the big hammer. Okay, out. so good stole. Welcome to Goots's toll. <laughs> right on, here you go. Is there how else? Yeah, I need? should Thank use you. some of these. How else big I hammer. Do for you? Nah. So no upgrades. Is all done then? Okay. No. Hey buddy. You be brave now, boy. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So Oh, we are going down there. So I will make make a check. Nah, not that. 1306. Anything that needs upgrading? Not really. All of the stuff that we are using is uh, upgraded. Okay, we'll just keep that point. Uh, let me save though. We haven't saved in a while. Drake's tail is right there, Clive. It's time to free Storm from the Crystal's curse. Let's go. Oh, it's past time. But remember... Bahamut is still out there. And I dare say we'll be seeing him again before the night is done. No more roads. We'll have to find our own path. Do you feel that, Clive? Ether. Akashics. Just what we need. Another flood. It's already turned. Then there's no reason to hold back. Hey, level 37. This Akashix will be a nuisance.
Must be a way to climb up. Where? Where? No, oh, that's where we came from, most probably. Ah, here. Judgment bolt. We are not using almost anything of Ramu except uh, this one. Lightning rod. So we have everything mastered. Right? Yes. Mastered, mastered. I am not using this one though. That's the way we'll go. Anything over here? I can sense another major fight is coming up. Is that a phoenix? Joshua! What is he doing? Keeping the Hamid occupied. Joshua! Joshua! It's too dangerous. Fuck! Hold on, Joshua! I'm coming! We have to save him. And we will. We just need to keep moving. More will be here. I ah oh, shit. What was that? Bahamut. He'll kill us all. There he is. Joshua! I'm here, brother! Clive. This is a big area, no? Not yet. After that get, that will be my guess, this will be a boss fight. Oh, oh, oh.
was the council chambers? How are they still standing? I don't know. Be all right, Clive. He's a survivor. We're getting close. What the hell is that? Ultima? No. Something that Ultima sent. It looks like somebody doesn't want us getting any closer. I don't care what it wants. Neither do I. Getting shredded. Oh, that did a lot of damage. Seven K, not bad. Oh, what is that? I don't want to know what that is. We have to end this right now.
You are done, dude. That was a tough fight. It's getting tougher. The favor of art. Tell Artima, we said no. These beasts, they're getting stronger. We can think about them later. Right now, there's only one thing we need to focus on. The heart. Okay, so how long has it been uh, for the recording? One hour, one minute. So we are total, I think, close to two hours of recording. So I will end it here. The, I think the icon fight will take another half an hour or so. So we'll continue from here. Hopefully you guys liked it. If you did like it, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. I'll see you with the next episode. Game Changer X out.